Sagradas. You might as well remember them from those movies where they eat everything and everyone that gets in their pot. Torn to bits, with not even the bones left. But the real question is, is that true? Will a group of piranhas gobble down your buddy Sean, so much as there's not even a bone left? You'll get your answer in just a minute. Known as a ferocious freshwater fish, the piranha is a small to medium-sized fish native to lakes and rivers in South America. Some have been found to inhabit warm bodies of water in North America, and in the Kaptai Lake in Bangladesh. A typical piranha diet consists of insects, fish, crustaceans, worms, carrion, seeds and other plant material. Some piranhas are even cannibals, so occasionally when resources are low and competition for food is high, piranhas have been known to take a chunk out of a fellow piranha, living or dead. Piranhas aren't apex predators, they're prey to caimans, birds, river dolphins, and other large pescatarian fish. So traveling in shoals has the effect of protecting the inner fish from attack. Further, shoals tend to have a hierarchy of larger, older fish towards the center and younger fish on the outer edges, suggesting that safety might be the true motivation. Despite their flesh-eating reputation, some piranhas are omnivorous, eating more seeds than meat, and some even subsist on plants alone. So, is Sean alive, or dead? Well according to studies, he will be mostly alive, if he doesn't have any cuts, and is calm. As piranhas seem to be attracted to noise, splashing, and blood. They do not hunt humans, and are rather shy, and protective. As said earlier, piranhas form groups for protection rather than hunting. A female piranha will lay about 5,000 eggs. The male's job is to fertilize them. But that's not where his participation ends. The male piranha will take this job so seriously that he will become territorial of the eggs and will protect them. Generally speaking, these fish are actually quite shy and are considered non-aggressive. However, when protecting eggs or their young, you may see a slightly different side to these fish. The average size of a piranha is 6 to 10 inches in length. Piranhas actually live longer in the wild, as they have a lifespan of up to 25 years. But in captivity, they only live between 10 and 20 years. Did you know that piranhas could bark? Well yeah, red-bellied piranhas have been observed making bark-like noises when caught by fishermen. Studies show that they make three distinctive types of noises based upon different situations and behavior. There is believed to be somewhere between 30 and 60 different piranha species. However, the exact number is unknown, debated and not yet scientifically proven. There are over 20 different species found in the Amazon River alone. That means, these dramatically portrayed river monsters are not going anywhere anytime soon. And you better check that river before stepping into it.